There's a little bit of magic happening at the Air Force Academy. Several Girl Scout troops were on hand to witness fire, ice, and explosions, all in the name of science. We like to kindle the fire for kids, and what I mean by that is we want to do something that's exciting for them that gets them interested in chemistry and science and engineering in general, uh, give them enough interest so they're going to want to learn more, and then go into more in-depth things at a later time in their life. The show is tied to Academy efforts to introduce school children to the subjects of science, to technology, engineering, go. and math, or STEM. What started in the 60s as a way to give back to the community has evolved into an institution. And we've done literally thousands of these magic shows since that time to, to tens and thousands of people all over southern Colorado and, and even across the country. The show is fun with a purpose. We need scientists and engineers to be able to design the new wow. weapon right. systems Very and nice to keep up uh, to make sure that we've got the best Air Force in the, in the world, which we certainly do now and we plan to in the future. The show builds on children's right. natural curiosity now, for STEM cool subjects. Something. Science has always been my favorite subject, and this inspired me even more. And so it makes like your boring science at school and you don't like it to fun science that you can actually have fun with. As fun as the show is, the real work has just begun. It's the, the kid that has to put in all the effort to become a scientist and engineer or to come here and to want to understand science and engineering even more. And so we feel that the job that the other teachers and their parents do along the way is a lot more important than ours. But if we can get it going, uh, hopefully that helps everybody. John Zanone, the United States Air Force Academy.